This video is going to provide a few examples for finding angles in transversal problems, level one within the Delta Math online system. So we're given parallel lines. So line M is parallel to line N. It says find the value of X. All right, so we're going to be looking at our different relationships we know um, for these problems. So we have five relationships. We have corresponding angles we know are congruent. We have alternate exterior angles we know are congruent. We have alternate interior angles are congruent. We have same side interior angles are supplementary, and we have same side exterior angles are supplementary. So lots of ways we can drive. Let's just go here and go, this is 163 because they're vertical angles. Well, now these two angles here are same side interior angles. So we know the relationship is supplementary. So we know it's X plus 163 has to equal 180. Now I could have also drove this way. This corresponds here, right? So this would be 163 corresponding angles. And then those form a linear pair, which means they're supplementary, which would have also been X plus 163 equals 180. So we subtract 163 from both sides. We're going to get X equals 17 degrees. Enter that in. Got it. Here's our next example. This time... They set us up right away. We, we are given alternate interior angles, and we know that alternate interior angles are congruent when the lines are parallel, so that means they have the same measure. So this is a quick one. Boom, 166. Submit the answer. Next problem. All right. This one, they actually gave us vertical angles. It has nothing to do with the parallel lines, um, but we know that vertical angles are always congruent, so we're just going to go, boom, 34 degrees. Okay, this one they gave us alternate interior angles again, so we know those are the same. All right, this one's kind of like the first one we just did. Um, if I go ahead and put the 160 up here, then I know I have same side interior angles, and they're supplementary, so it's going to be 180 minus 160, so it's 20 degrees. And then here we have alternate interior angles, so they are going to be the same measure. They're congruent, so it's 28 degrees. That's it for this level one. 